DFCCIL, where the journey begins. In a progressive country, change is constant, change is inevitable. There are many factors that influence the growth of a nation like that of human resources, physical capital, natural resources and technology. Railways have been the instrument of technology development and growth in India. Today, Indian Railways is proud to boast about its laurels and achievements as the dedicated Freight Corridor Corporation of India is about to launch the world's second largest operation control center OCC at Priyagraj Uttar Pradesh for trains to carry goods and is all set to go into operation in full swing. A proposed site located within the railway land opposite to Subedar Ganj railway station along GT Road was selected to build this world-class infrastructure. From acquiring the land for construction for the OCC in 2018 to laying down its foundation, a thorough research and planning was done by professional engineers and master architects and a blueprint was finally laid down. Keeping in mind the time constraint, a vigorous day and night work schedule was laid down where laborers and other railway officers got down in completing this mammoth task, which went on for two years of strenuous planning and execution resulting in the launch of OCC in 2020 under the remarkable supervision of Alstom and the undertaking of DFCCIL. This is the state-of-the-art operation control center that will act as the command center for the entire route length of 1,856 kilometers of the eastern dedicated freight corridor. Built at Prayagraj in Uttar Pradesh, the center will be the nerve center of the eastern dedicated freight corridor. It will not only connect the existing ports and industrial areas for faster movement of goods, as you enter the main gate, which is well guarded by security persons as well as the state-of-the-art camera units for 24 by 7 surveillance and security. All sorts of precautions are taken for any kind of external encroachments and these barbed wires definitely solve this problem. The external lighting done by using LED fixtures which run on solar energy saves electric power supply usage. The Operation Control Center Green Building with a rating of Driha 4, Solar Power Generation and Rainwater Harvesting System. There is also use of heat resistant glazing for high performance glass with low E value for provision of outdoor lighting fixture. An arrangement for grid supply with DG power backup is also done. Another important feature that makes the project environmentally friendly is the STP or the sewer treatment plant and equipped with gas fire suppression system, acquiring a 5 BEE star rating. As you enter the building complex, you will be amazed to see the well-lit reception area, high ceiling, cool interior. In order to beautify the place further with natural props, these planters have been placed all across the building that not only makes the place appealing but also environmentally friendly. Various sections have been compartmentalized for specific purposes. The conference room, cafeteria, functional and maintained for ease and service to the OCC employees and staff members. The basement area is equipped with various disaster management tools like these nitrogen cylinders which are used in case of any emergency. Special care has been taken for the supply of the electricity within and outside of the building and to keep the functioning working 24-7 without any power disruption, a backup support is also in use. The network management deployed is of the highest level which is controlled by heavy-duty servers dedicated to keep the functioning undisturbed. As we move to the first floor of the OCC building, we can see that it is equipped with a theater complex which houses controlling stations equipped with train management system and also control units. The operational control center is built by DFCCIL. The center boasts modern interiors, best-in-class acoustics and it has been designed ergonomically 
considering the needs of traffic controllers. The highlight of this center is the 90 meter long video wall to control the entire train operations on the said route. The user-friendly representation of railway infrastructure and its state-of-the-art display at video wall system at OCC ensures instantaneous update of train traffic and another signaling assets. The OCC building is an extremely guarded entity. In order to avoid any security breach, the surveillance cameras are installed both outside and inside of the building premises to keep a track of any movement. These cameras are functional 24-7 and give a 180-degree view of the location and are operated and monitored by using joysticks internally by the assigned staff members only. With first-of-its-kind integrated supervisory control and data acquisition SCADA system for traction and non-traction power supply and train management system TMS. इस ऑपरेशनल कंट्रोल सेंटर की ना सिर्फ हमने बिल्डिंग बहुत अच्छी बनाई है बहुत अच्छी मतलब ये सारा सस्टेनेबल मटेरियल से बनाया गया है ग्रह रेटिंग की बिल्डिंग है हमने इसमें ग्रेज्ड पेवर ब्लॉक लगाए हैं हमने इसमें इंसुलेशन मटेरियल का यूज़ किया है इसमें कॉस्टिक्स किए इसमें सोलर सप्लाई का यूज़ किया है इसको एल लाइट्स यूज़ किए हैं इससे इसकी ग्रह की रेटिंग आ चुकी है ये बिल्डिंग में इसमें सबसे बड़ा फीचर है एक ऑपरेशनल थिएटर का जो जिसमें करीब 80 मीटर के आसपास की वीडियो वॉल है इस वीडियो वॉल से पूरे 1800 किलोमीटर जो कि हमारा लुधियाना से लेके दानपुनी का सेक्शन आएगा इस ईडीएफसी वन ईडीएफसी का उस सेक्शन की कंट्रोलिंग हम ऑपरेशनल कंट्रोल सेंटर से कर सकते हैं द बिरूनी स्टेशन सिचुएटेड इन उत्तर प्रदेश स्टेट ऑफ इंडिया इज अ बिजी स्टेशन विद कॉन्स्टेंट रनिंग ऑफ ट्रेन एज पार्ट ऑफ इट्स डेली रूटीन Under the OCC operation, this station functions, monitors and does maintenance of trains both independently and also through the remote access control system from the OCC which will enable traction controllers to monitor, control as well as remotely operate power supply equipment at traction substations, sectioning and paralleling posts for the entire network. Also it will allow monitoring as well as control of other auxiliary substations and equipment like HVAC high voltage AC fire alarm at depots stations and OCC from single location a user friendly and adaptable real time control and display of train movement and signaling and telecommunication system with automatic supervision under make in india initiative has been developed by DFCCIL traction scada matlab supervisory control and data acquisition system jisko hum popularly scada kehte hain isme hamare paas jo 120 132 kb ya 220 kb ki jo state traction substation bus supply aati hai ek jisko hum ek tss hote hain jisme different switches transformer isolators and jo controls hote hain un control ka operation hum scada se kar sakte hain one of the station that has been developed and is functional under the OCC is that of Tundla a small yet busy station located in Uttar Pradesh state of India the operation controlling maintenance and functioning of the trains can be managed both locally and from the OCC through remote access provision OCC is connected on a dedicated backbone optical fiber network to various station locations along the section 4 real time field data exchanges the field interface is achieved through front end processors which communicate with the smart lock interlocking systems the data from field is processed at centralized level to perform the various train management system real time information allows good decision making and thus ensures high levels of mobility within the system to channelize and synchronize the time pan india a master clock is installed all the 10 stations will have dedicated interlocking equipment ci excel smi ooc relay rack data logger block instrument cubicle only in few junction stations usi se mein hamare paas ek teesra system hai that is train management system so complete train ka management hum usi se se karte hain ट्रेन का मूवमेंट मॉनिटर करते हैं ट्रेन की कंट्रोलिंग करते हैं ट्रेन का ऑपरेशन करते हैं ट्रेन के मूवमेंट को ट्रैक किया जाता है तो ये कंप्लीट आप ये मान के चलिए कि लुधियाना से दानगुनी के सेक्शन में हम ईच ट्रेन की पोजीशन, 
क्या है उसको हम मॉनिटर कर सकते हैं उसकी टाइम टेबलिंग कर सकते हैं उसका फोरकास्ट कर सकते हैं तो जिससे कि हमारे जो कस्टमर्स होंगे उनको ये फोरकास्ट मिलेगा कि ये गाड़ी हमारे इस समय में टाइम टेबल से चल रही है इतना जैसे आज की डेट में पैसेंजर ट्रेन चलती है इस तरह से हमारे सिस्टम में गुड्स ट्रेन चलेगी तो गुड्स ट्रेन को हम टाइम टेबल से चलाएंगे और पैसेंजर को फोरकास्ट दे सकेंगे और एक गारंटेड अश्योर डिलीवरी दे सकेंगे जो एक बहुत बड़ा फीचर है डी का जो अभी तक इंडियन रेलवेज में नहीं होता था सपोर्ट सिस्टम कनेक्टेड इन इंटरलॉकिंग ट्रांसमिशन नेटवर्क एंड टी एम एस इक्विपमेंट कनेक्टेड इन टी एम एस बैकबोन ट्रांसमिशन नेटवर्क स्पेशल फीचर दैट मेक्स द मोमेंट ऑफ द ट्रेन स्मूथ इज द सिग्नलिंग मॉनिटरिंग सिस्टम अ रेलवे सिग्नल इज अ विजुअल डिस्प्ले डिवाइस दैट कन्वेज इंस्ट्रक्शन और प्रोवाइड एडवांस वार्निंग ऑफ इंस्ट्रक्शन रिगार्डिंग द ड्राइवर्स अथॉरिटी टू प्रोसीड The driver interprets the signal syndication and acts accordingly. These red, yellow, double yellow and green indicators stand for the movement of the train on the track to avoid any emergency or eventuality. The LC gates or the level crossing gates may be in the form of lifting barriers or movable gates of approved design. A remote alarm monitoring for railway systems is used to keep an eye on the stretches of track. and supporting telecom towers everywhere what needs monitoring railways install remote terminal units false in the supply if any will be noticed immediately through the video wall and can be acted upon by the operators the pdh nms or the plesiochronos digital hierarchy network management system is a technology used in telecommunication network to transport large quantity of data over digital transport equipment OCC follows a simple structure of IoT Internet of Things maintenance of rail tracks by deploying sensors across track systems which are positioned along the inside of the track to be ready for and avoid service interruptions caused by adverse weather conditions like fog rain storm or winds now station master can control track shifting just in one single click from its own station and there is no need to pull any lever edfc tms can handle management of 300 trains per day both ways and has built in features to configure as ctc centralized traffic control to operate and manage train traffic this is an excellent example of make in india as procurement of materials and development to a great extent has been done in india by indian engineers of dfccil with the support of contractor asipl and pmc engineer sai tipsa OCC has been made keeping in mind all types of situations like in the case when accidents or natural disasters affect train operations it is also possible for the control system to deploy all of its elements to change the plan accordingly so that there is a minimal disruption the building is earthquake proof as well as the disaster management techniques used here are world class OCC control room is planned to be manned by a 250 strong staff in each shift. Once operational, the corridor will not only decongest the existing railway lines but also increase the average speed of good trains of 6500 metric ton load from current 25 km per hour to 75 km per hour with maximum speed of 100 km per hour. The formation of OCC will ensure that each and every goods trains passing or scheduled in this line from Ludhiana to Dhangui is monitored, controlled, maintained and functional properly. This will help in ensuring a guarantee to the customer about a short delivery time in date of any goods being taken through these trains. This will not only build trust but also help in smooth and timely functioning of the goods train. saving a lot of time money and energy involved in this transaction or process undoubtedly today imaging the railway transportation in india without the operational control center or occ is simply unthinkable we congratulate dfccil for establishing this world class body and making india outshine on the global horizon yet again the control center which we have constructed in prayagraj is one of the uh, biggest control center uh, globally and this will 
control the entire operation of trains right from Ludhiana to Sonnagar, which will be around uh, 1500 km. And there are there will be seven boards, and all the activities of train operation will be controlled from this uh, control center. Mm -hmm.